The future looks a bit brighter for the farmers in the West Gonja district in the northern region of Ghana as a result of an innovative project managed by the organization ADRA and financed by Danida. ADRA and Danida. Adra and Danida helped us become better farmers. They taught us the best farming practices. We've become more productive and can now take better care of our families, says Lada Biri, one of the local farmers. The overall aim of the project was to train and assist farmers to graduate from subsistence to commercial farming. We trained them on business development skills so that they will be able to approach farming as a business rather than as a way of life. The three-year project looked at the whole value chain and took an integrated approach to agriculture. Integrated in the sense that we looked at all the aspects of production um, and then marketing as well as the linkages with the various actors in the value chain. We trained the farmers on crop production, so maize, rice, soya beans and granite. The farmers were also trained to improve soil fertility by using organic and inorganic fertilizers and introducing new practices such as crop rotation, intercropping and green manuring. And greater part of the farmers adopted this technology and were able to more than triple their yields um, from three bags per acre to 10 bags per acre. Comfort Bamboa, a female farmer from the area, explains that before she received training, the harvest was bad. She didn't earn enough money to take care of her family. Adra also helped us getting a tricycle we can use to transport our products. We've become more productive and we don't suffer from poverty anymore, says Comfort Bamboa. Ardo made use of a wide range of tools to achieve and sustain the results. We've learned that the farmers don't need handouts. Just teaching them alone does not achieve results, but teaching them through practice, field demonstrations, farmer field schools, field days, is able to let the farmers see what you, they hear and practice what they hear. The training of voluntary extension workers was another key aspect of the project. The extension services that through the, the normal system is gradually going down. So we train 722 volunteer extension workers. We benefited because the first thing we don't know how to plant things. We just plant it anyhow, but they taught us how to open uh, the line. So I also go around and teach my colleagues. Isaac Kankampuadu is confident that the results of the project will last. Even though the project officers will no longer be there to be able to produce the regular extension services for the farmers, the volunteers will continue to provide the extension services. Boot Noah, another local farmer, has gained valuable insight from the project. It has taught us ways to increase our production and to adapt to changing weather and climate patterns, he explains. Almost 28,000 farmers were trained directly through the program. On top of this, thousands of other farmers were reached through radio programs.